Hey everybody, Arnaldo Wofferman here with my DMX video manuals. Today I want to talk to you about how to trigger your scenes using your keyboard. Now remember that not all these videos that I'm showing you work with my DMX buddy unless you upgrade to the full version of my DMX. I'll be doing a video on that pretty soon as well. But here's how this works. So of course we have our setup, editor, and live. If you understood none of that, please make sure to watch the previous tutorials to get you up to speed. So I just have just a couple very basic scenes, nothing, you know, killer, but all that matters is that we can trigger them. So let's go ahead and take a look what we have here. When we right click, we have a learn keyboard command. Super easy. We're just going to right click and I'm going to choose a letter. Bam, I've chosen the letter B. For this one, I'm going to choose the letter W and I can do W as well. Notice the one is in uppercase and one isn't because I held the shift key down. So if I hold the shift key, that one turns on. If I don't, that one goes like that. And of course, if I want to black out, I'll hit B. Of course, if that's too confusing using the shift key, you can do, let's go ahead and uh, learn keyboard command and let's do Q. So there we go, we've got W, Q, and B. Now, why did I start off with the shift key? Because a lot of people ask, can you use a shift key? So this way you could, for example, make dual scenes, right? So you could have a slow moving scene with let's say red and white and then if you hold the shift key and you hit that same button again now it's a fast moving scene using red and white just a much easier way to classify things now of course you can use your button so there it is right there that's including symbols so i'm going to learn keyboard commands shift and six there it is right there uh, learn keyboard commands so now we have seven so there's seven right there. If I hold six, nothing happens. Shift and six. There it is right there. And we can black out to go there. So again, hopefully that helps you guys out a little bit. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions or comments or requests, please leave them in the comments below. Thanks so much for watching. Good night and God bless.